Okay. So, hello and welcome back to War Tales. Now, we're gonna go for Matthias Lund. I think that's the name, isn't it? Yeah, Matthias Lund. Now, we've got somewhere here Lucilla Lund's medallion. Maybe, maybe that will open up some special dialogue or something. If we go and talk to him again. So. Oh, it's these farmers again. Right. I take it this doesn't like give us more stuff, does it? Sometimes it does. Oh my god. Very nice. So does that mean the other one will potentially give me some stuff again? Ooh, the possibilities. So there's the Lund farm. Stormcat mill. And there he is. Um right. Let's get ready. We're probably gonna need this. <laughs> Right. Drop the safety save. Make preparations for our last supper. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Pay the wages. Now, I take it that we can't stack these. Right. I'm assuming that we can't. Okay. Must eat meat at every meal to be satisfied. Talk, Rollo the Destroyer, the Braggart. My old mother used to say that mercenaries never eat their fill. If only she'd seen yesterday's meal, a feast worthy of uh, brokers. So we can sing. Uh, pick up camp and leave earlier than usual. Get satiated. Uh, satiated. Screw at the bottom of yesterday's plate and save it. And save it one last mouth. I don't know what satiated, uh, satiated means in terms of the game. Like I know what the word means, but like I've no idea what that effect is, and I can't look at it. Okay. Sure. Um, he'll have that on him then. We'll consume zero f food during the next rest. Oh. Right. Interesting. There's the big guy. Am 
Let's talk it out. Lucilla, I'll kill them all. Is there no way to... Hmm. Yeah, just fight and fight Lund. Okay. I mean, we've, we've killed the guy, Matthias. If, if you won't come along, because I didn't bother buying shackles and I probably should have. Big fella and all, isn't it? Right, I guess I'll engage him first. I do, I remember the strategy with this guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The strategy with this guy is to... Leave yourself room to get out of the way of him, isn't it? tank a lot. Put protection on. We also have a load more Valor points going into this this time. Yep. <laughs> One. That, though, will hit a hell of a lot harder. Yeah, at least it was an insta kill now, though. It looks like it's going to be a while before it hits again, so. Some poison. I don't want to be too far away. That's what I'm actually wanting to do now. Uh, but I don't think I can quite make it. I'm hoping to make it to Helma so that I can end, end my turn next to an ally to gain the Valor points. But it's fine. Nail through the armor. Don't go into the. Oh dear. This will be painful.
Right. Um, encouragement to give everyone protection. Galvanize to gain the valor points back. And, uh, Brace ourselves, I guess, is just what we're going to have to do here. Really start hitting him. We've got to just keep smacking him now. That's going to... Oh, they don't go down. Yeah, they just die. So our wolf is dead. Damn. So there's no second chance on animals or anything. Now, well, Helmer can just move. What else have we got as we need to turn? Yeah, I guess it's just going to be real, though. weakening so we really want to keep that on. That is terrifying. The Warhammer with a handle wrapped in human skin, the first name Lucilia, with clumsily engraved on it. Whose skin was this anyway? Lucilia's Revenge skill. Deal 150 strength damage to all units in the area. Knocks them back by 6 meters at the start of the next turn. So I think that's like a super coup de gras, isn't it? Yeah. There we go. And we can report to this haven as well. And that sudden influx of, influx of cash should get us a border pass finally, which will allow us to do that other mission. Right. I've been waiting for you. We all have. After seeing everything you've done for us, we've taken an important decision. This ruin will not be our haven. You have shown us that more than a roof over our head uh, that more than a roof over our heads we need our dignity back. We will leave this forsaken place and demand that Stormcat treat us like the human beings we are. We will not back down. Please come and support us in this as you have in our previous endeavours. Oh, we'll get a border pass. Ah, so we could buy a second border pass from this. If we so wished. So do the refugees that come here and go up there? 
Is that just kind of what happens? With that? Huh. Interesting. Um, or do they just happen to be going that way? Don't know. Oh well. Um, we could go that way or we can take the scenic route and see if there's anything in the mine that's popped up. I'm not against the scenic route. Is this where I saw that there was an ornate key? Or was that at the... So I say, I'm sure there was something here. There it is. That's where the ornate key is, and I think it was up at the sawmill, wasn't it? Right, can I get any of these to give me that? No, I've just got... If they've moved into the place, I do wonder if it's... If they even know that that's there. But oh well. Maybe it's not specifically that key. Maybe there's just ways of obtaining ornate keys. I suppose if you kicked them out of there on that mission, it'd be free for the taking. But alternatively, you could just steal it from under them there. And yep, it respawns. Oop, too quick. Right. Oop. Now each one of these is enough to make like a weapon or something. Which is kind of crazy when you think about it. Yeah, we're getting to a point where we could almost make a living from our trades here. You know, we could just mine iron as we're going around and turn it into weaponry and armors and then sell them. Literally, we've got 50 iron. You know, we could turn that into a bunch of armor and what we don't wear, sell. And then. Yeah, so we'll have just a ton of armour just knocking about that we can use, or like say, sell. Looks like the standoff's happening. Drop the save. The Lady Mayoress, she didn't want to hear it, but we won't give up. We're prepared to fight. Are you with us? probably shouldn't be fighting, you're not exactly going to make yourself, you know, not really the way of getting about it, but that said, if they're not going to let you stay or anything, you know, it's rock in a hard place, isn't it, really? Oh, we've got leaders aggression, they've got leaders inspiration, so they've got double movement, we've got um, always crit, so we got the more powerful boon, I think, there. Um, <clears throat> right. Yeah, we have to pay some close attention around here. Okay, right. Helen wants to go here. She can get straight on to these three. That means she's going to want backup someone who's good at AoE, so that's going to be Taurus. Oh, I can move these as well. Okay, uh, in that case, we'll send Taurus around this way. 
Anna, you're going to go here because you can shoot over this. Rolo, you're going to keep watch for her. I was going to say I can send Seekrim, but then I remembered what happened. <laughs> Not great. Hmm. Right. I'll go here. Do try and stay safer over there. Right. Let's open it up then. Oh, she hasn't got the valor for it. That's unlike her. What was... What the hell was that? It's like, oh, hey, instead of, like, you know, attacking, I've just walked over there. Great. I clicked on the attack button, but I guess the game just didn't register that. Or, I don't know, weird. And there's an, an undo button in this. Right. So it was Taurus here, refugee leader there, I was going to go up in the middle, Lauren you were going there, Rolo's going over this way, Anna is going there, Helena was up here, looks good. So, as I was saying. terrible she's just they're, they're just slightly too far apart she's just not really able to do much unfortunately uh, thanks for coming over your stupidity is appreciated Oh, right, she's getting an injury after this. Um, oh, that's Lady Mayoress, okay. Oh, and she is really badly hurt immediately. Damn. Maybe Lauren will be better off going over here. Eh, a bit of burning, who cares? As long as you don't stand in it, you're fine. Let's try and take one of them out quickly. Honestly, don't know who's who there. It's the bad guy one. Damn. Our guy won down here. Might actually be a decent strategy that. Get in there and uh, if you can save them right away. They might get attacked and against some of the other people knocking about here. Eh? Hmm. Right. Ow. <laughs> Ooh. They're poisoned and they're standing in it. <laughs> Not good news. Right. 
Okay, how are we going to handle this? Okay, he's going to take his turn and basically crap all over here. If I disengage, I will basically die. So we've got to somehow get Helner out of there. And it's looking a bit desperate. Ooh. got to make sure that bitch ah uh, right. this might require some rethinking so Helena cannot reach all three she doesn't have the valor to throw in poison either which is bad we really need her to have her valor up which we can't do at the moment Um, Doss is doing pretty well down here. As was Rollo up there. Right. I'll go in with Lauren's support, and these two will flank around the side. Right. And I'll just basically tank. Right. Looks good. Still not close enough to them, but whatever. <coughs> Ooh, that's going to scare. I get right up in his grill and give him a good, good stabbing. Right, we've won that one at least. Um, almost one up there, an enemy, yeah. They're going to hit both of us, so prioritise getting them, because they're, they're going to smack harder. Okay, they're stupid. <laughs> Hits themselves for 14. I think that's our guy, isn't it? Yeah, it is. These that actually do things afterwards as well, they're gonna come and help. That'd be nice. Ah, oh, I forgot to swap his weapon out for that new one as well. Damn. Oh, 
that is just going to hurt if they're standing around in there. So I've probably got another turn to live. And a good backstab. Ooh. Could still go either way, though. Yep, as predicted, he's hitting both. Ooh, that bleed is not good. Okay, another little smack. There we go. Enemy reinforcements are on the way. That one guy, but we've got one guy as well with five health. He's gonna sneak in, hopefully. Explode. Great. Really well thought out, guy. Ooh. That's gonna suck. Right. Too bad that I can't hit someone else I'm not facing. So I wouldn't mind turning around and just killing this guy. But never mind, they're gone. The hired help did actually do something. Well, I guess I'm the hired help, but the main thief who hired me. I knew this is a freebie, isn't it? I'm just helping them, aren't I? Anyway, I'm getting a border pass out of it, so it's 200 gold worth. Plus, with that contract to hand in as well, so we're going to get an absolutely massive boom to our, uh, our mercenary troop for this. I'm going to say please don't hit Rolo. That's probably one of those where I should have probably aimed rather than just going haha four in five chance. Because if it missed Rolo was dead. Oh, he's literally dying here. Oh, wow. One thing I will say, I think that Stormcap would have a special map for it, wouldn't they, maybe? But, oh well. Not continue loot all, then continue. Any last words? 
You've no right to be here. Stormcap is a free village that only belongs to its people. You're nothing but parasites, too cowardly to fight for your own land. We're here because our land was burned down. Because our craftsmen were drafted. Because our families are starving. All we wanted was for you to welcome us in. So what are we going to do now? Kill the villagers of Stormcap, don their clothes and seize their goods? Sleep in their beds and replace our people with your own? No. We only want villagers to share. Had you done so in the first place, the situation would never have escalated. I will be the new mayor, whilst you and your supporters will be hung. As for you mercenaries, thank you for helping with the storm of the peace. As long as uh, Edwin is torn by a conflict, the new council of Stormcap will welcome refugees with open arms. Claim your reward and know that you will always be welcome here. Right. I think we've earned a good rest. Hell, I'm almost tempted to uh, buy a room at the inn for once. I'm feeling that generous today. <laughs> Collect the bounty. Ooh, big bounty. North. Uh, sure. Oh, that's very close by, actually. Do we get, like, high-level adventures coming here yet? No. Okay. So what is a room for... The Ooh! Beer's going cheap. The beer is going cheap. Um... 51. Christ, that's expensive. We must be using like two rooms up now or something daft. Um, oh, Bassett's leveled up. Uh, fight away armor plating. No, they are way too expensive for that. Um, hmm. We have a few things to sell now, don't we? Oh, that's terrifying. Strength plus eight, plus nine, plus eight. Taurus cannot equip this kind of weapon. Yeah, it's got to be axes with him. Oh, he has a double injury. Movement, finally. Yes, double movement. Excellent. And we're level 5. Each time this unit engages, they gain deflection. Each time this unit engages, they gain repost. The next time this unit is attacked by their engaged opponent, they parry with an attack of opportunity. Cancelled if we move. As long as uh, as long as a bonus is active on this unit, their attacks apply weakening for one round. Huh. Right. Hardcore training, immune to bleeding, poison, and burning. Jesus Christ. Uh, Daring's not bad. 
but I think probably these two are great. Um, I think we'll go counter-attack. As long as we're not engaging multiple enemies, we'll charge in, they'll swing back, and we'll instead hit them. Gets an extra attack in, and attack is the best form of defence. Because, you know, it'll end the fight fast and thus make us take less hits, right. I bet I'm supplying him with as many weapons as he's making. Right. Armour plus 11, guard plus 13. Armour is 5. Okay, that is significantly better. Um, I mean, can helmet even, like, cannot equip a shield? No, so, yeah, literally no one can use this and it's broken. Oh, so that protection skill that it had was from this. Encouragement. Protection gains deflection. And he can just use defensive stance. But that does use up his attack ability. Hmm. So, significantly less armor. But, gives us protection. Hmm. Now, we're, get, we're getting rid. Got a much better one. Right, what stuff have we got plenty of? I mean, we've got so much iron now. To say we were struggling for it a while back. I suppose we can just use this Lund thing now. Right. Iron ore could be sold for four. Well, I've got a lot of it to spare, but we do need lots of it to make things. I wouldn't mind, actually. Um, I mean, what, what do we need to make some uh, better stuff here? So, first of all, we could make some reinforced layers. But secondly, we could... Um, now, we don't want the pony arm, that's fine. Um, but, what we could start doing is looking at uh, some of these items here, learning them, and making those. And that, yeah, that will require a lot more stuff. Um, really, we need to get this... Uh, knowledge bar up. We'll probably get that to go up quite a bit when we go into this new area. Because discovering new areas, it says specifically, is a good way of doing it there, so. That could be a really solid way of uh, leveling that up. So the town hall, it should now have a new mayor in. They haven't exactly welcomed the refugees with open arms, but never matter. They can just obey their new Lady Mayoress for all I care. Um, but you're the, but you're the uh, mayor now. Mayoress? No, look, mayor. You're, you're a mayor, right? <laughs> Right, how are we doing here? We can heal for 60. Oh, 
alternative would be our own medicine because we've got plenty knocking about right now. Yeah, I tell you what. Right, let's inspect. Uh, can all be chosen to complete tasks? Medicine. Taurus. Medicine. Medicine. Craft. Apprentice alchemist. Medicine. Four. Boom. Done. Job's good and four vials of medicine. Got a bunch of these incendiary flasks as well. The the aim with those and why they're sat in the inventory is to eventually just burn down one of those nests. Hopefully. Um Right. And we've got plenty of rope knocking about. Um, okay. Did we, like, find more rope or something? Is that where we got it from? Is there anything going cheap at the market? Because sometimes there is. We'll have a quick look. Then we'll call it here for the episode. We never managed to sell those, uh, rat those rats then. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't believe that he bought those off us. Ridiculous. Well, I guess that's NPCs for you. They have to bring them any old crap and they've got to take it. Because that's just how the game is. Right. Thank you very much for watching. That's going to do it for this episode. Next time, we'll do this mission up here quickly. Take the money, run off to the border. And start making waves over there. So I'll hope to see you for that. Yeah, I'll see you then. Thanks for watching.